So here's my little uh, supercharged injected water intercooler Volkswagen. It's a 2110cc engine uh, with thick 92 jugs. And the problem I was having was, as you can see with the supercharger, there is no way to put a distributor or a cam sink on this thing. And I didn't think I was going to have to have one. I was just going to run it in uh, batch injection and wasted spark. But because of the cam, which is uh, got a lot of duration, uh, it uh, I was having problems with the idle. I couldn't idle this thing down below about 1500. Uh, and it's because of the the, uh, the I had, it, it has to inject twice, so it injects when it doesn't need it, when it's in batch fire. And with the long duration of the cam, it was causing some real problems with the fuel flow. So I had an idea uh, based on Ecotech. Uh, they do it totally differently, but when you have uh, two cylinders that are opposing and you're in wasted spark mode, the one that has compression versus the one that's on the exhaust stroke, one of them is just a few microseconds before the other. So I figured if I could pick that up and turn that into a cam phase, uh, then I wouldn't need to try to figure out how to get uh, something to detect the cam phase. So I have these little pickups. Those are actually made for tachometers, but I had to put a, I had to put a little circuit board inside of them uh, because I was getting such crosstalk across the lines. So I had to do some conditioning inside there. That's one of them. And there's the other. And I've got them on cylinders two and four, which are on a Volkswagen or opposing, one, four, three, two. And I've had this working on a breadboard, but I've not had it working on a final product. Well, when I say product, I'm not trying to sell the thing. I'm just trying to make something for myself. So I have this circuit board here that I made and two of those connections go to the sensors and one goes back to the MS3X cam input on the on the uh, controller. And assuming that this thing works. It did on the bench, but this is real life, and I've learned a long time ago there's a big difference. That lead should flash there uh, with the cam phase as it goes uh, through the cycles. And I have an indicator on the dash that'll tell me if I'm in cam sync or not. The MS3X starts up wasted spark. It looks for the cam sync signal, and if it finds four in a row that are 1010, in other words, the order they should be, then uh, within uh, 10 cycles, so you only have seven cycles to get it right, then it locks that in, ignores the signal from then on, because it knows where it is by the crank sensor. So we're going to give this a go. I'm going to have to put this phone down because I'll have to feather the throttle. And we're going to see if we get cam sync.